picking up a book from a friend of mine. She's having to, I think I said it, I had to help my friend move into a hotel a couple weeks ago. And uh, she's still there, unfortunately, and her whole, whole house is torn apart. <laughs> it's an absolutely awful situation. They're spending thousands of dollars staying in this hotel until their house gets put back together. And today she offered to let me borrow this book for book club, Small Things small things like these um i figured you know what that's a very small book 100 pages to it maybe i'll go to one book club this year <laughs> might host it myself oh my gosh i am so cold i've done my walk run I, uh, run i think i ran for off and on like about a mile and a half I was pretty consistent for a mile and a half. Got to four miles for the morning. Oh man, I'm so cold. Had my little hot packs. I need to have heat on. Oh, so I'm very cold. Um, so I went for this walk and I stopped to get this book for my friend. But because she's living in a hotel and can't drive, um, she has had like five brain injuries, so she's, she can't drive. Um, she's bored. She's bored out of her mind and she's frustrated with the progress of her house. And so she's like, can you just come visit? Which is fine. She's a good friend to chat with. But um, now I'm really hungry and tired and cold. I really need to go home and take a shower. I do also need to go to Target and get some meds at the pharmacy and then just a few small things that we just don't get at Costco but I'm freezing and I'm starving <laughs> like I am not I'm just wearing like capri leggings I am so cold where's my out for this hotel come on where's the out oh I went the wrong way so I didn't I didn't feel as good doing my run today but it did feel good like you know, I just didn't have as much momentum as I did yesterday when I ran, but it was colder today and it started to rain. So that really did like start to kind of affect me on my run today. Um, so, but it, it was okay. The other thing I need to do today is put up Halloween decorations. And yes, the crafty woman has not decorated for Halloween and Halloween is tomorrow. <laughs> Can you say lame? I am like so disappointed in myself, but I also just don't care. I do care for actual Halloween, so I am kind of glad that I didn't like have to sit and look at all the decorations for longer because I really can't stand Halloween decor. I don't like orange. I don't like the color orange. So I should put the decorations out well, before I shower, but I'm literally too freezing. I was gonna do it right after my walk when I was hot, but I'm, I'm too cold now. I'm freezing cold. So I'm gonna go home, shower, get something to eat, and then I guess we're gonna decorate for Halloween. I'm not gonna do it all. I'm just gonna maybe gather it up and convince the kids to set it up tonight. Jason needs to help me get the ladder out and uh, put lights up and all that kind of stuff. All so. right, I have cleaned up. I just want to show you. <laughs> all right, horrible lighting. Maybe it's better. If... Yeah, it's a little bit better. Um, I just haven't like worn a pair of jeans. The top of my jeans are right here. I haven't worn jeans and a shirt and outfit that, and yes, there's still my apron belly right there that is still visible. Normally I would have hidden that, but I haven't like worn a shirt. Like I have a t-shirt underneath. I haven't wanted to like wear a t-shirt and have it just like hit at this top of my pants, like ever. 
because it like is flatter. Yes, I've still got stuff down here which is gonna get taken care of later, but like I think these jeans were a good purchase. Meanwhile, I am trying to decorate the porch for Halloween. Abby is picking up our neighbor. She babysits our neighbor. Um, so let's go look and see what I've done so far. I'm not gonna be able to do much else right now just because if you can't hear, it's pouring rain. <laughs> and because this cobweb that I got, the girls tried to use it the other day and it just falls apart. It doesn't actually like open up. I'm gonna try this one. The other one that they tried, sneeze. The other one that they tried, um, it just, it, it didn't work. So I'm gonna try that one here in a second. Um, but normally we do cobwebs like out in the yard and whatnot, and I am not going out in that rain. <laughs> it's not gonna happen. Um, okay, so far we do have the cute little spider web that I got from the dollar store. It was $5, can you even see it? I turned the lights on just so that I could, you know, kind of get my vibe going on. But here's the spider web, and then I've got this netting going across here and then dangling. And I like things to be symmetrical <laughs> in some way, even with spooky Halloween decor. So I have this one on that side. We do have the house lights on still, cause you know, we're lazy like that. Um, but I do have this set of lights that I could have put up as well. I just think that we're gonna wanna have these um, out on the bush. And I definitely want, I thought we had another set. We have a bigger one. I have a bigger set. I don't think I brought, anyway. We have like the big ones that are like the patio lights. I don't think, I think maybe we have a second pair and they're in a bucket. I think it's just up high. Um, I just need to, Jason to do this with me. I just <laughs> should have done this when it wasn't raining. Also, we have Chelsea's pumpkin here. So, unfortunately, I'm not doing a ton. Um, when I get, do catch a dry spell, I do have some spider webs, or spiders. I could put that on the little web that I do have out there. So here's the one, let me turn you. This is the one that they already opened, and it literally just doesn't open and, and like spread out. It's just like a big cotton ball. It's just kind of a mess. So I don't really know what to do with that. I do want the kids to put away all their shoes before tomorrow night so that this space is nice and clear. Um, I do have my costume. I do plan on doing my costume at the door, which will be really fun. And it's really dark in here. <laughs> um, I will use my costume at the door, which will be really fun. We do have a trunk or treat tonight at our church, but um, Ashley has cheer and she's like the only one who would actually care to go. And she has cheer, so I can't. So anyway, I do need to go to Target. I might go to Target now because then I can wait, come back and get, oh my gosh, just, I should just wait. And I'll go to Target when I take Ashley to cheer. That's what I, the logical decision to do. So I guess I'll go do some computer work in the time frame, in the time being. I do have laundry to do as well. Okay, I'm at Target. Um, I'm trying to buy socks. I, this maybe doesn't sound weird, but because we own a shoe store, I, I don't have to buy my socks. <laughs> Jason always has them for me. Um, but I have my new shoes on. Yes, shocking. I'm not wearing my flip-flops. <laughs> Broke these out today. Um, and I, I want taller socks. Like, I don't mind wearing these sometimes, but my ankles do get cold in the winter. That seems, you know, normally I love my flip-flops and they don't get cold, but I need to get some socks that kind of come up my ankle a little bit. Um, but a lot of the socks that I have are a lot taller than this and they're kind of annoying. Also, like, they're not sports socks. The socks I have are like, not dress socks, but they're just nicer socks. So I wanted some sport ones. So I'm just gonna get these guys and we'll get medicine from the pharmacy and then I think that's it. Maybe I'll peruse. Maybe I'll peruse for just a bit. 
people walking by. Um, dropped Ashley off at Cheer and then came to Target. So I'm actually looking at some of these like pajama sets. They're kind of cute. Because a lot of time I don't like change into my pajamas because they're short pajamas. They're shorts or and a, like a shirt. They're for my surgery, if you guys remember those. So I can't walk around the house in them because they're, um, because it's cold. Um, but I wore sweatpants, not like, well, I guess they're sweatpants, but I put sweatpants on last night, walked downstairs, and <laughs> let's just say I was holding a whole bunch of things in my hand to go downstairs, and I lost my pants. They're they're too big. <laughs> they they were on the ground by the time I got to the bottom of the stairs. I really don't want to keep buying things as I lose my weight. <laughs> it's just kind of annoying that I don't have anything. And I lost the cinch on it. Like I lost a little string to cinch them up. And they're really old. They literally have paint splatters on them. I'm debating. I do have one more pair of sweatpants, like pajama pants that I can like wear around the house. But, um, I don't know. So I'm looking at some pajamas. These are cute. Like waffle knit. I like the ones with like an elastic ankle. Those are kind of cute. I like gray better. 30 bucks for a pajama pant. I don't think so. I didn't even pay that for jeans. <laughs> wow, our orange lighting is really being a... Uh, Matching the season. Um, just went and got Ashley pulled out the cars to get some of the Halloween buckets out. Found two witch hats, a spider web, a bunch of spiders. Actually, a couple spider webs. Spiders. And Ashley, I found your deluxe large trick or treat bag. Yeah, you can use that tomorrow night. Um, ooh, the lights outside look kind of cool. We can't find the other lights I wanted to use. So we're just going to call it good. It is what it is. I do have two sets that I'm going to put out tomorrow morning after I go walking. We'll show you this for now and then we're going to... Oh, you can't see me. I mean, that looks kind of cool. Little cobweb. You can actually do different like light settings. So there's one. Ooh, that's having a hard time focus. <laughs> Oops, I'm holding on it. Yeah, that's crazy. Although that little flashy thing could draw attention. Or just plain, I guess we're, oh, no, fading. That's kind of cool. I think the kind of mix of, okay, that's off. There's quite a few different settings. So we'll have to decide tomorrow night. Maybe I need a break. Maybe that's why I fade into this bitter taste. I think I'll let it be.